Bulak. Uh, the squad has been uh, released uh, yesterday uh, with the lack of fullback is um, Sunye Turwa, uh, Tiko Maichapani, Kevin Nagama, Semi Valime, Mike Sivo, uh, Six the House, uh, City Mode and Rake and Brandon Wakem. Forward we got Abikoso, uh, Kini, King Guyawa. Tweekam Kamida, William Kikau, and Joshua Wong. Lama at number 13. Uh, on my take on the back line, I think Sunya Turuwa will add more power there. I think he's been really, really good at training. Add a lot of energy with whatever we're doing, uh, practice in attack and defense. On the forward, we got a young, upcoming Fijian boy. I think we should keep an eye on his uh, Joshua Wong. Joshua Wong from the Roosters. Um, yeah, he's been learning from Bilami Kiko, as we know, uh, Kiko, one of the best second row in the game. So, so far, we, we've been going really well. Uh, we focused on ourselves last week. Whatever happened last week, we leave it behind. I keep telling the boys to focus on Fiji first. As the game come closer, then we start focusing on whatever Australia, the way they play and what they do. Uh, yeah, it, it changed. The, we can see the team. They change the way they do things around. Uh, when the boys arrive, a lot of things changes um, off the field. They are the leadership. Uh, their leadership is second to none. Uh, on the football field, yeah, they had a lot of experience. Uh, all those boys are all NRL players. Uh, majority of them um, in their position, they number one, like the kicker, the Sibo. They done really well. Well, they had a lot of depth, a lot of experience. Our game plan changed. Everything involved around Api and the boys at the back. Well, the game against England, um, there's a lot of things we need to look at. Um, a lot of people look at the points, but I look at different things. Um, as assistant coach, we're looking at uh, minimize our mistakes. I think that's one of the biggest thing we tend to find, especially our national team. We seem to uh, drop the ball a lot. So the game is all about possession. If we control the ball and complete it 70 percent, we're in a good chance. So it's, uh, last week. I think our let us down is our completion. We didn't complete our completion is below, and our defense. So that's two things we need to fix this week. This week is we gotta keep it simple. We keep the possession. When the opportunity comes, we take the opportunity. Our defense we're gonna work hard from inside out. So last week we cut everything, not taking away what England uh, done, but we just need to improve our defense as a group as a team. Well, I think they got a good, a strong side. Even though they keep telling you oh, they got about 13 made their debut. You know, that's Australian <laughs> debut. They all play state of origin. As we all know, the state of origin is one of the uh, unique uh, game. If you play in one of them games or two, you know, you're one of the best. Only the best play for the state of origin. So they they got 30, uh, 13 debut on. But I know they're strong. They got a very strong lineup. You know, that's not, uh, let's not take away what we prepare for. So rugby league is a very simple sport. Anyone can win if they put their mind to it. Oh, there's no special recipe on rugby league. Uh, I think we just need to complete our sets, um, get the field position. And when we got in a good ball position, we just let, take the try. Try to get into a try straight away. You know, we're going to get on top of them. If we don't get on top of Australian team, you know, we have to work a bit harder. So I think if we compl our completion rate should be much better than last week and defend really well as a group, I think we should work really hard. And The boys are looking forward to it and they want to give Australia a go this weekend. So I'm looking forward to it. Uh, the boys are pumped, so let's see how they go on um, Saturday. Oh, no, firstly, you know, things do happen. I know a lot of people... Um, read what happened to Joe, but I'm lucky enough to be here. Um, I was here last Thursday. Uh, I was here last Thursday when things happened with Joe Romelli. I was just happened to be here and uh, the boys asked, management asked me if I can step up and um, work really well with um, our technical advisor. And we got a good team. Uh, we got uh, Brian McDermott, uh, Webster, who I played with at Paramount Hills back in the days. And uh, not forgetting Johnny Wesley. As a group, we have a meeting every day. We talk, we go visit Joe, make sure he's all right. Um, yeah, we all got to work together. It's not only for us and it's for the long term. I uh, keep reminding the boys and uh, I don't ever forget where we come from. And all the kids back home, they look up to you. So 
So anything we do, we got to make sure we stay humble and work hard for each other.